Previously, in the anime, Makoto discovered that his world, the Demi-Plain, now has wolves and huge bears as well, so when he got to the forest to meet them, he decided to let them live as they want, but while that was happening, Jean, one of the student had a crush on this one girl from his village, but when they found a lab of chimeras, that time, Jean saw her true power and accidentally called her monster, which was obviously a easiest way to ruin a relationship, so from then on he decided to get stronger to find the girl to confess his love. For that Jean and his team fought their first strongest monster to level up, and the girl he had a crush on, was none other than Sophia, and she happens to be a creation of Luto the Greater Dragon, and aside from that mess, the students were preparing for the festival, people gather here from all over the places, making it a busy week, plus there was a competition that students were preparing for, and Makoto was preparing his shop to handle the customers for the week, their Luto came in to get Makoto to have fun around, but he was getting in the way, so he told Luto to get lost, and there. Shiki once heard Luto had an experiment once and got curious to know the details, but someone came in and turns out he was from the church, named Shurnai the priest, Makoto told him he can't talk due to the curse, so he'll talk with words, Shurnai got here because of the medicine Makoto sells, some jealous kids thinks that medicine is far more effective than the price, and Makoto new temple is after some bribe. But that shameless temple wants to handle the sales of medicine, because temples wants to clear the rumor only on one condition, they get the production methods of medicine. They want to check if the process is edible, but if Makoto gives the method, won't Temple create that same medicine to sell? Shurnai believed his offer was generous enough, and Makoto knew there were many high priests involved in human experiment, and one of them was killed by Rona, so Makoto played into their hands and agreed to reveal the method for now with obviously a little twist, then the next day, Makoto visited the church which reminded him of that nonsense goddess, there he met the bishop, and she acted like all high and loving lady concerned for Makoto and his curse. She promises to look for a way to cure him and leaves, then he shows all the ingredients for the medicine and Shiki goes to show them the method, there Shurnai learns from Makoto that he became a merchant three years ago but has had a lot of success in short time. So Makoto told him he got help from Rembrandt company so he achieved his success in short time, he lent Makoto a storefront and all business knowledge with generosity, but Shurnai knew a different version of Rembrandt Company and they weren't cooperating with the church, Makoto instantly knew it's because church refused to help his family, so Rembrandt gave up on church. Makoto was looking after his daughters in return for their generosity, after which the investigation ends, then Makoto left, and Bishop came to warn Shurnai to ask for permission to get involved with Makoto because her attempt to test Makoto's mana failed, so no ordinary servant could tail him, plus his method to make medicine was fishy too, it looked simple at first, but they could only have a 50% chance of creating the medicine, more so the cost to create it would be 100 times the price Makoto sells, Bishop knew he's a peculiar case, and at the sell's time, Jean came to coax over Eris to know the secret of being powerful, Makoto saw that and bribed Aqua with banana milk to spill the history of what happened. And then, Eris was caught red-handed slacking off and betrayed by her partner, but for this once Makoto left her, but wanted Jean to be careful not to cheat or else Makoto want him to leave his class, so Makoto was off for deliveries and found assassins, so he quietly goes to a silent place away from eyes, to lure out the kids, they surrounded him to gang up on Makoto, but his dense mana was impossible to break. But he recognized this one guy from before, and this time he brought out the dagger. Made by the greater dragon Mitsurugui, that's a fine weapon. But the person who made this couldn't win against Makoto, so how would a kid like him could, so that takes care of the business there, but Makoto was really pissed off for some reason, and there Tomo comes and showed some places perfect to open gates to stabilize weather at Demi Plain, but the area is under demon's control, with a fortress nearby, and attacking them means turning them into enemies, so Makoto needed some time to think. Then, the first day of festival comes, and Mio and Tomo welcome themselves in the city, while Makoto overslept. The shop was overflowing with customers, and a dwarf and lime were managing the crowd outside, many adventurers were flocking in after hearing the praises of Makoto's products, but all the while Shiki lets Makoto sleep this late because his waifus came over and saw him sleeping, so they ordered Shiki to let their future husband sleep some more, 
so Makoto walks out for a moment and saw a girl from Laurel, and after completing their work, all the staffs gets to the restaurant to celebrate, but Shiki had some dangerous experiment idea, their Luria brought them their ordered, as restaurant was packed bad, but her sister Eva was helping them out, and with that, the party begins, and, the Japanese type girl Makoto saw was from the Laurel Nation and wants their priestess back, she was accompanying the hero Otonasi Hibiki, but Laurel Nation blamed the Limia Kingdom for kidnapping their priestess, so the king told them to send their own guards for the priestess. But she was bent on taking the priestess back home and gave the king some time to think it over, and our real. Protagonists finally lost their minds and started getting rowdy after the party. They looked like party monkeys, but Princess Lily was observing our protagonist from afar. But that's where episode 13 ends. Personally, I can't wait to see Makoto kicking the heck out of Tomoki and Lily, but there's still time before that, but subscribe to the channel if you're also waiting for the same thing. Until then, take care.